My grandfather, Baba's husband, was one of the kindest people in my life. We called him Zeta. Zeta always seemed to make the best of any situation, to keep positive even in the face of unrelentingly negative situations. When Baba's Alzheimer's progressed beyond a manageable point, he moved with her into a home for the aged. She lived upstairs with the patients and he lived downstairs with the spouses. I was 17 and went to visit them after school on Friday afternoons. Sometimes sitting in his room beside his bed, you could hear them up there, the demented, the delusional, the dying, yelling and cursing and crying out. Fortunately, while the patients upstairs were losing their minds, the spouses downstairs were losing their hearing. There wasn't a television on the floor that wasn't set to maximum volume. Zeta would ask me about school and we'd talk about my plans for after graduation. Baba and Zeta had been married for over 50 years and he visited her up there every day. He joked about the nonsensical things she said to him, the insults she flung at the nurses. He gave me hope. If he could find laughter in this hell, maybe there could be hope for us all. Maybe death didn't have to destroy the life around it. Thank you.